Hey, what's up guys? Camp Russia here. Welcome back everybody to another Fortnite video. Another big one for you today. Chapter 3 version of Jonesy. Donald Musters teased us again. All things live event. The Chapter 2 finale. A little bit of Star Wars. We even got Darth Vader talk in here. And let's just get into it. There's lots as usual. It's the last week basically here. We got a week and one day left of Chapter 2. So we got some work to do here as a Fortnite news channel. The Master of Espionage has arrived on the island grab the Nick Fury outfit and the rest of the shield set in the shop now this dropped yesterday uh, I'm gonna remind you right now code the camp and rusher if you type it in now then it's gonna be in there for the battle pass and I uh, yeah it helps more than ever is when you type the code in when you're buying the battle pass because everyone's spending right let's be honest so thanks to everyone who uses my code love that this skin got added this was teased so long ago and finally they give it to us right i feel like this was during the marvel season we thought we were going to get nick fury so uh yeah i'll be picking it up for sure big fan of the skin and uh the character now Fortnite, as they love to do, they're hyping us up. Here's a tweet they dropped today, this morning. Remember that first drop feeling? An undiscovered world with new secrets to unfold. Why, why, why do you, it gives me goosebumps, man. I, I don't know, I'm a big nerd or something. I just, uh, this is the right job for me because even this line gives me goosebumps. I remember my first drop. The music playing, right? The music was firing me up. I went and dropped right under uh, no-name location where the big dam is, right? I, don't, I don't, still don't know what to call that spot, but that's where I first dropped, uh, close to Slurpee Swamp there, right? Uh, yeah, and just amazed, right? I, we're gonna get that feeling again in eight days, well, 10 days. The fourth is the live event, and it's Tuesday the 7th is the new season. So there'll be three days of Black Hole uh, from what I understand. So, okay, we gotta wait 11 days, all right? Patience, but with that being said, Seeing as this is the end of chapter two, uh, this guy here, Mysteri, Mysteri Ice, I decided to make a list of every single mythic and exotic as well as the map showing the location of every one this season. You can see, I mostly wanted to show off how many different exotics and mythics they dropped on us this season. Uh, I'm critical, but I also try to uh, congratulate when they do good things. And there was a lot of variety in the weapon pool and uh, yeah, I liked it. I was a fan of it this season. Also, Fitzy, sorry, we're just doing a bit of appreciation here. Uh, some of the best POIs. As I'm scrolling through them, what was your favorite POI throughout the entirety of Chapter 2? My top two, I would say, are the Shark and the um, Tony Stark, Stark Industries. Those are my top two. Uh, just memory-wise, the amount of fun I had fighting at those POIs. Uh, was awesome, but some of the ones you're seeing as well, I would include. Oh, I'm just ah, I'm getting fired up, man. It's been, it's almost a little sad though, right? We got play some Fortnite, enjoy the chapter two map. Well, you got some time this week. I know that's what I've been trying to do: play less creative, play more pubs, and just just enjoy it. Take it all in because this is it. All right, we're we're gonna be nostalgic for this map here. Uh, you know, a month, two months, year down the line. So get it in, get your enjoyment in before we're done. Okay, we're gonna talk about some news though. Uh, with the the teaser, right? The the classic teaser, the chapter two finale loading screen. There's four skins, and I just wanted to point this out uh, from Luna. She does it for me, but I've heard this a couple times. Locke represents save the world. Agent Peely represents the battle pass. Mecha Cuddle Master represents Fortnite crew. Trixie rep represents creative customization. Battle Royale is the course, so no, no matter where you're in from the game, we all come together to fight the Cube Queen. And I think they are trying to illustrate that. Everybody, from every corner of the Fortnite universe, we come together and, and we take the Cube Queen and her army on uh, Saturday, December 4th. Can't wait. Live stream, by the way. Make sure you join me. I hope to see you here, man. I've already got it prepped up. I, uh, I'm hyped, man. I love, I, love live, I love the live events and I love the live streams. I'm so fired up for it. Next here, this is from Donald Mustard. He's been doing way more videos and some of it's appreciation, but of course he throws a teaser in. This one's a big deal. Take a look. So one of my most favorite characters in all of Fortnite, especially in Chapter 2, is Agent Jones. And uh, just so much fun that we get to have with that awesome character. I love the idea of this person who works for the Imagined Order and believes in what they're doing and has worked with them for a long, long time. And every time they have to go into the loop for some reason, that they, they leave a snapshot of themselves. And that's why 
We have all these different kind of versions of Jones that we've seen through the years. But I love that we've been able to build up to that uh, that big moment in season five, especially where you know he's bringing all these different hunters in from all these realities, and then finally he's just sick of it. He realizes like that what he's been doing is wrong, and goes to get the help of the Seven. Um, and there's a lot more in store for for Agent Jones. Uh, so I did this quick, quick sketch of one of my favorite outfits of, of Jones. He doesn't stop, man. I, I think he gets just as much of a high from creating the storyline and telling us the Fortnite story as he does with teasing us. <laughs> that little face at the end he made. So we haven't obviously seen this version of Jones. This is a, a, a sketch of our boy Jones captured by the I.O. So I don't know if we're going to get to see, and there's also this fan art here based on that, even cooler. My gosh, man, fire me up. Uh, but yeah, so there. So with, are we going to get to see it in the live event? Are we going to get to see what happened? Or are we going to have to wait till chapter three? I'm not too sure, but uh, he's been captured. We assume it's the I.O., and, he, and obviously that's going to play an important part going forward. Man, Donald, you know what you're doing, man. You know what you're doing. The Team Brawl LTM trios has been activated. I'm probably going to... Uh, get, I like this game mode. This is a good game mode. So you can test it out here. It's in the rotation if you haven't tried it before. If you have, yeah, get back to it. One, one, of, the, one of my favorites. Also, I just want to point out that in the background of that video, there was a Gravity Falls book uh, and uh, Darth Vader. All right, teasers for Darth Vader. Uh, he, and this has been, I mean, first off, Gravity Falls, he's uh, so much of the Fortnite stuff is based off that show and Donald Mustard has said he's a big fan of that show and he, he draws inspiration. Uh, but he's also d done this on Instagram, right? Some of the books that have inspired and taught me the most in my life. Uh, and obviously we've seen uh, some collabs already, Star Wars included. But yeah, we're waiting for Darth Vader specifically. That would be uh, just an epic, epic skin. You can actually see a Darth Vader helmet and a C-3PO image, both Star Wars characters, of course, in the background. He's teased collabs with Matrix, Wonder Woman, Dune, and more the same way, just saying. So yeah, this we're not just pulling this out of thin air. This most likely means something. Uh, I think it's just a, <laughs> there's this funny photo. <laughs> we got Spider-Man confirmed. Darth Vader, I was just about to say, it's not a matter of if, I think it's when. Uh, so yeah, chapter three, right? Fortnite chapter three. <laughs> oh, that cracks me up. And some other uh, screenshots coming through here for you. A bunch of different stuff. I'll have all these guys linked down below. Anytime, by the way, I use these guys in my thumbnail, I do credit and I send them payment because I, you know, they're talented. I want to send them money and I use them in the thumbnails or whatever to help generate hype. So I, I obviously want them to be compensated. So I just want people to know that. I get people tweeting at me or whatever. I really do appreciate these guys' art. I had to add this in last minute. There's still one more piece of news following this, but HypeX just tweeted this. A full trailer for the Chapter 2 finale is planned to drop soon, according to the artist that made the Watch It All Fall song, which was featured in the teaser, right? We heard that in the teaser. And yeah, so full teaser trailer coming soon. It's not out yet, but as soon as it is, uh, check my channel and we will be talking about it. Had to add that in. Oh, and to finish off the video here, I, I should mention this. All those Australian, New Zealand Fortnite teasers led to uh, this. Welcome to the lands down under. Hit the beach, save the kiwi, enjoy a meat pie, and build your own Aussie trade em trade empire. Uh, explore the island today and you can see it there. So that's what they were teasing. I'm sure it's a cool one. Give it a shot. I'm probably going to go give it a shot just because they've, they've teased it so much. It must have some quality to it. Thanks so much for watching. Subscribe on your way out. Take care. Talk soon. Goodbye.